InfoMed, safety is our top priority. We understand the importance of routine monitoring and assuring the integrity of the sterilization process. Often, this comes at high costs and complexity, so we have developed a good treatment practice GTP system, which provides cost-effective on-site system integrity tools. InvoMed 80 users have the ability to monitor performance and guarantee full compliance with regulations. Before beginning the Biosetic Integrity Performance Verification process, please ensure you have the appropriate kit and equipment, which can be ordered from Envomed.com. This test is designed to verify the Envomed 80 system integrity. The indicator will show optimal condition results only if a combination of correct concentration, established time and temperature has been reached. The Envomed 80 user interface will notify you when it is time to run the scheduled Biosetic Integrity Performance Verification Procedure. Press the GTP button followed by the Biosetic Integrity button on the Envomed 80 touchscreen to initiate the pretest sequence. When indicated, input your testing strip's lot number before opening the testing port hatch and removing the testing port canister. A barcode reader option is available. Open the test port hatch and remove the testing port canister. Insert one chemical test strip into the testing port and return the testing port cage to its designated location within the Envomed 80 unit. Allow the Envomed 80 to process the test strip according to the established program. Process Verification Biosetic Integrity the test will take around 15 minutes and the Envomed 80 will notify you when the process is complete. You can then remove the test strip and compare the results with the Results Reference Guide to establish the PAA levels within your biosetic. Before beginning the performance verification process, please ensure you have the appropriate kit and equipment, which can be ordered from Envomed.com. The Biological Performance Verification Test provides empirical evidence of the elimination of spores following the sterilization process and provides conclusive proof of the effectiveness of the treatment. The process is carried out in a liquid phase ensuring both the liquid and solid waste are sterilized in compliance with STAT Level 4. We recommend that biological performance verification should take place at least once per month, according to the recommendations of the STAT. The Envomed 80 user interface will notify you when it is time to run the scheduled biological performance verification process. Press the GTP button followed by the Disinfection Performance Verification button to start. Insert one envelope of the 6-log Geobacillus Stereothermophilus spore strip inside the testing port and return the testing port cage to the Envomed 80 unit. Process the test strip according to the established program Disinfection Performance Verification. The test will take approximately 12 minutes. After the process completes, the envelope should be removed from the test port cage and transferred immediately to the laboratory for Phase 2. The Envomed 80's GUI will notify you when it is safe to do so. In sterile conditions, carefully open the envelope at the end marked Peel Off and transfer the spore strip using sterile forceps to a growth medium tube.
Be sure to avoid any contact between the spore strip and any other surface, including the outer part of the growth medium tube and the envelope. Use a spore strip which has not been subjected to the disinfection process as a positive control whenever a processed strip is incubated. Positive control guarantees that the incubation was carried out under appropriate conditions. Incubate the processed spore strip along with the positive control strip for 24 hours at 60 degrees Celsius, making observations every 10 hours. The EnvoMed 80 will not allow additional tests to be performed during the 24-hour incubation period. If after 24 hours no color change is visible on the growth medium tube, the disinfection process was successful. However, if the growth medium indicator color turns yellow, this indicates a failure in the disinfection process. The positive control spore should turn to yellow in order for the results to be valid. After completion of Phase 2, record the result on the EnvoMed 80 unit via the touchscreen. The results will be stored and documented in the EnvoMed 80 secured database, ready to be printed or exported with full compliance with audit trail requirements. For more information, contact the EnvoMed team via envomed.com. Thank you for watching.